Alex at windowcleaner.com. One of the more confusing things or something that can put a little apprehension in somebody from purchasing a scraper is how do the blades change? Can you change the blades? What blades do I need? And just how do I do it? Somebody help me. So I wanna make a quick video and show you how you go about changing the razor blade insert in a few different styles of razors that we sell at windowcleaner.com. All right, so one of our more popular is the Unger Ninja. Um, got some cool functions, but today I'm just gonna show you how to change the blade in here. The recommended blades for these are the Unger Premium. There's four inch and six inch. This happens to be the six inch. So carefully remove the cap. And you'll notice the scraper has a little tab on it right there. You can press it with your finger, um, but I just recommend using any kind of hard surface to press that. And the blade will begin to slide out the other side on this insert. Carefully remove it. Safely discard of the old razor blade. Take a single new blade. When you get a pack of blades, you're gonna notice they are a little oily, which is a good thing. That oil is gonna keep them from rusting and sticking together. Oops, I actually have two, look at that. Super thin. Line up the holes on the insert like so, and slide it back into your scraper. So you're gonna go notch side first into the side of the scraper that has room for that notch to slide in. Carefully bring it all the way back in. And once you press it through and this little tab is sticking out, it is locked in place, it's not going to come out. Always be sure when not in use to cover your scraper. Next up, Ederay, we have two different types of Ederay scrapers here, a five inch Champion and a six inch Pro Plus, different blades, different styles. Let me show you how they work. Again, carefully remove the cap. With the Champion, there is a little tab to depress. Depress that, slide it just a little bit, and it's gonna come out the other side. You have the insert, you have the blade. Get yourself a fresh blade, discard of the old one carefully. Doesn't matter which way is up or down, it is a reversible blade. Line up the holes with the little tabs on the scraper and insert it back the same way. So that little yellow tab pops right there, cover it up, you're good to go. With the six inch Pro Plus, uh, I recommend obviously using the Pro Plus blades. This is a pack which you can store the old, dirty, cracked, beat razor blades inside here. Remove your cap. There are always little tabs on any kind of cap. Remove, tab right here, depress, and the insert will slide out. Once you have the insert out, Take your old blade and discard it in the back side of this pack of razors. Slide it in gently, carefully, and the entire blade will fit in there. Press down on the new side and you're going to get a fresh blade out of here. Line the holes on the blade with the tabs on the slide and insert it the same way back into the scraper. All the way back in. Cover up. So we already covered one type of Unger. This is the other. This is a four inch scraper. We have the Maxi and we have the Unger scraper right here. These use a different kind of blade. So this small blade is two-sided like the others, but one side is blunt and the other side is a razor blade. So you have the option to use a completely blunt edge. That comes in handy with a scraper like this. It's actually used in a few different industries. This can be used as a grill scraper. It can be used as a floor scraper to get gum off tile or, or polished concrete. But for our case, we're gonna put the razor blade side in because we're window cleaners, right? With the small maxi scraper, there is a little button right here to depress. When you do so, it will release the pressure on the blade. Put a new blade in. You're gonna to have to just kind of feel. There are still holes in this blade and there are little notches inside here but you just kind of got to wiggle it around till you feel it kind of fall into place. It can be a little nerve wracking when using the razor blade side, but that's okay. Opposite side, there's a button that I just pushed to lock it back tight. 
and your cap goes right on. With this Unger scraper, you will need a screwdriver, a flathead screwdriver. I'm gonna simply loosen. Don't go nuts, don't go taking the screws out completely. Just loosen it a little bit. We got a little bit of wiggle, but it needs to come out just a little bit more. And just like that, there goes our blade. New blade, same deal. Just got a feel for it. And you can press the other side, the bottom here, up a tad, put a little pressure on it, and you'll see it's in place with just a little bit of wiggle that you're gonna take out when you tighten these two screws back up. Just like that, you're back in business with a new blade. Hope that was helpful. If you have any more questions, be sure to head over to windowcleaner.com, click on the live chat, and one of our reps will be certainly happy to help you.